A task force in Anchorage is working to find solutions for people with complex behavioral health issues in Anchorage who are at risk of homelessness. Steve Kirch attended a leadership summit today hosted by the task force. Rebecca, the homeless crisis has many layers to it. And since May, the task force has been peeling away at those layers. The task force says its work has culminated in two, three main priorities. One of the priorities identified is a need for a no barrier year round shelter. The task force's recommendation suggests individuals with complex behavioral health issues often have barrier barriers to shelter and housing. Now, in case you missed it, last week the assembly voted down funding a 150 bed mass shelter in East Anchorage. However, this proposal from the task force suggests the creation of a five smaller shelter sites of approximately 50 people each. Assemblymember Daniel Bolin, who attended the meeting, said smaller sites is sort of a path to success when it comes to shelter. Well, I, I think that, you know, it's been rare that we've seen a, a large shelter model uh, be well operated in Anchorage. Um, you know, with, with the Sullivan Arena, for instance, we saw a lot of room for improvement and uh, felt like we needed to, to bring in third party oversight. I think it's, it just gets harder uh, to scale. You know, when you're at those large numbers, you have a lot of folks with, with various needs that need to be met. Additionally, he said the task force will submit a final report recommend, recommending mid to long term solutions to the assembly on September 5th.